Hey everybody, welcome back to Minor Stuff. I'm Matt. I'm Pat. And we're, we're the, the Minor, Minor Brothers. Brothers. Today we're going over the bourbons that we're going to be hunting for this upcoming fall. Let's get into it. Alright, welcome back everybody. Before we get started with what we're hunting this fall, please subscribe to the channel, like this video, drop some comments down below. Um, speaking of comments down below, Matt, it's going to help you win something, right? Yes, yeah, so we're going to do a random giveaway today. We have this uh, brand new rocks glass in, uh, engraved with our logo into it. Um, at the end of the, the show today, we're going to give you a little thing to do that will enter you in. And next Friday, we're going to pick a winner for this glass. So, Matt, what are we drinking today? We're drinking some uh, Smoke Wagon Uncut Unfiltered. Absolutely freaking oh, delicious. So and this stuff is hammering to it. What is this one at? 57.8 so yeah it's, it's definitely awesome. yummy yummy um, all right so we all know that September starts bourbon heritage month and usually you start getting a lot of good good releases right Pat yep so one of the stuff is obviously the biggest one is Old Forester birthday bourbon comes out Huge. This year, it's an online release, so you have to enter online. They're not actually selling it down uh, down at the yeah, distillery. No camping out. It can only be you have to do it online, which is great because it gives a whole bunch of us a better chance of getting it. You still have to go to Kentucky to pick up your bottle, though, which oh. I would gladly do if I can win. Oh yeah, without a shadow of a doubt, that's worth. So every needs penny. to say that's going to be number one on our list of what we're going to be we, going. We've after. already entered to win, and it's a short period. It actually might have already closed. I don't remember how long it was going for, but it was a short period that it was actually open yeah. to win. Um, so make sure you hop on over to Old Forester's website, check it out, and get entered to win. So what's one of the next ones that you're looking forward to? So I was I loved Remus Repeal last year. Made it pretty clear, I think, on here. How, how big of a fan I was of it. Remus Repeal 6 is coming out. I am looking forward to it. I'm looking I, forward to it too. It's going to be awesome, I think. So I heard already that they went a lot younger on it. And I mean, Remus Repeal 5 was old. It had some good it, age to yeah, it. It had it. some good flavor to it. It's got 6 is a lot to live up to. Yep. So, it's a lot to follow. Um, so 6 gets released in September. Yep. So by the time this video pops out, it's going to be time that it will start slowly hitting shelves all over the place. Yep. Uh, one of the next ones that we're going to be looking forward to, one of our favorite fall sort of ones to grab, Midwinter Night's Dram. Well, this is going to be uh, number 10, which they're calling the Encore. The last year's was amazing. It was fire. It was awesome. So I am very looking forward to this one hopefully we can find it it's a it's another one that's really hard to find you have to kind of be um there when it drops in order to get it because yep. the day i got ours was by sheer luck and there was like six seven people all waiting in line to get it i just happened to be in front of them which was nice so yeah. so um that one is also going to start dropping Late September, usually you start seeing it in like October, November-ish, depending on how quickly shipping ends up being. Um, you know, last year up here in New Hampshire, it didn't drop to like, I want to say it was the beginning of December. Um, it was it was a while. And um, which leads us into our next one, Stag. So Stag usually does, uh, you know, a couple releases. Um, up here, we they just released Batch 12 last year, so this year we'll be on Stag Junior 13. Um, so we're way behind the times, but it's because New shipping. Hampshire liquor store sucks. We're just gonna get that out there. I By like the time it. they get everything out and whatever else, so that's something that's coming up that we but have to look forward stag, to. Stag, the original it. one, it's no longer Stag Junior, it's just Stag. And Batch One just draw, was released this past. I want to say it was June, according to the calendar, um, somewhere around June. So you're gonna start seeing that slowly pop up. Once again, shipping time to get out there. Obviously, if people are holding on to it, it's going to go, I'm assuming, pretty high in secondary so, anyways. So, what well, would have been Stag Junior 18 is Stag Batch 1. Batch 1, yep. Okay. Uh, that's coming in at like 131 proof or something like that. So, that would be a good one to find, too, if we could find it. That would be one of our neighboring states that we'll be trying to get. Yes. Um, as soon as we can. And, to find and any out of the that. people out there that are watching this, if you guys happen to see it, you want to pick a bottle up for us, we'll definitely work out a deal with you for it. 
So keep that in mind for us. Help us all out. Uh, um, so another good one that, that we're sort of looking forward to is Makers. So you had Makers, FAE01, FAE02 doing the wood finishing series. Uh, the new one that they're going to be coming out with is BRT-01. Um, so I'm looking forward to that one. Yeah. I've been a huge Makers fan anyways, especially Makers castrate stuff really sort of hits the, the stuff. The FAE01, FAE02 was phenomenal. Yep. Um, so we're looking forward to the BRT-01, which I believe had a September release. Yes. Um, according to the calendar. So probably see it in October or something like that. But it's still, it's coming. Like, this is going to be the it's, best time of the year for... It's got a lot to live up to, though, for the... It does. FAE-01, so... Um, this is the time of year, though. You're going to get a lot, a lot of good, good drops coming. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, you're going to have the Pappy collection coming out, the BTAC collection, which everybody's going to save for um, for a lot of the drawings and raffles. Four Roses limited edition is going to be coming out, too. That's another good one we'd like to get, but yep. that'll probably end up being just in the raffles with all that other type of stuff. Um, the only other one that I, I've been actually looking forward to is the uh, Penelope Architect. Build number three is going to be released. Um and I want to say it's going to be released in like November, December. So it's going to be the, the later part of the, the year. Um, but that's going to be another good one. Penelope yep. and those architects have been pretty they good. Were, yes. Yeah. yeah. I The architect series from Penelope, I am definitely pleased with. Some of the other stuff I have hasn't really, you know, blown my socks off. But the architect series is definitely, definitely a hit for Penelope. Yeah, it definitely has been a good one. So, um, yeah, so... If you guys, you can go to like Breaking Bourbon, um, they have a calendar with all the releases at month by month, um, and you guys can always look for, there's a ton of other stuff coming out, obviously Barrel Bourbon's going to have their New Year edition coming, um, you know, Yellowstone has some stuff coming out, like a whole bunch of people drop a whole bunch of stuff. Searching for those calendars is really important, like Matt, put up above us the Bourbon Hunting Tips video right up here, you guys can click on that and see how we've got so much stuff in the last year, it's been crazy. Um, it's because we've kind of got the tips and tricks down and we're sharing those with you in this video right here So make sure you click that yeah, if you're just getting into it. it like, you know There's some stuff everybody's like, oh, I'm looking for this. I'm looking for this It only drops in the spring So if you're gonna be looking for it all fall You're probably not gonna find it unless you're gonna hit one of those stores Which is like the museums and they're gonna be charging, you know, triple what retail should be um, Other than that, you're not gonna see it until the next spring comes along by following those calendars along it allows you to be right on par with when they're sort of getting dropped. Like I said, trucking delays and other things can put it, you know, within a month or so, but it gives you an idea of when to really start right. pushing for your hunt. Um, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to start really pushing. I, I think September, you're going to start seeing a couple of things, good things drop, but October, and where we are, usually really starts hitting the shelves um, for surrounding states. New Hampshire is just... Uh, whatever, when, whenever they get around to a type of thing, they just sort of, they're, like I said, behind. But it'll come out eventually. Yeah. So let us know in the comments down below what you guys are looking for. Also, for this glass, what we're going to do is you're going to do hashtag man shit in your comments. So if you're a subscriber, like the video, put a comment down below with hashtag man shit. And next Friday, we're going to be doing a video for our review of the Rabbit Air, which we're giving a another try again today um so when we do a lot lately yeah using it quite a bit so when we go to do our review on the rabbit air we will pick a winner out in the comments you have to come back and into this video and look in the comments section we'll we'll tag we'll, the winner down below so we can get your email address and, and arrange for us to ship it out to you but that is the uh that is the giveaway today so everybody we hope you guys like this video follow us along for the man shit and everybody have a good day